А ви знаєте, я просто лежала. You know, I thought, God, she's so strong. How does she put up with this? It wasn't for a year or two years. She suffered from this sickness for nine years. I was praying and I was crying out to Jesus. I cried out to him. I just opened my heart and said, God, if you really exist, come into my life. I trust you. I surrender to you, Lord. Here I am with all this sickness. Just come and heal my life. Heal my body, heal my soul. I trusted him. You need to know that you have to have your own goal in order for the Holy Spirit to come to you and to touch you and to take your hands. This is real, friends. This is real. It's all real. The Apostle prayed for the breaking of the spirit of witchcraft, and at that moment I felt that it was being broken in my family. Because my grandmother had a problems with her health, my dad had a problems with his legs, and at that moment I knew that this prayer was for me. There is a specific demon of witchcraft here. I say right now, devil, get out, touch! And when the apostle came up to me to pray for me, I felt very strong opposition inside. Hallelujah, devil! Leave her alone. Leave her now. Leave her now. He began to pray, and I began to cry. I began to free myself from this generational spirit of witchcraft. Right now, I'm telling you to get out of her. Get out of her. I fell down because of the strong anointing. I was crying out of joy. I was overwhelmed with joy. I felt victory inside, but not only for myself, but I felt the victory for my whole generation. And I realized everything will be all right now. I was not just walking from the stage, but I was flying. 